We've heard the harrowing tales of migrants making their way to Greece. Many do not survive the trip across the Aegean Sea. Tonight, as part of our NewsHour Shares, a look at trying to get refugees comfortable with water and the sea to help alleviate stress. Independent producer Micah Guerin sent this report from Lesbos, Greece. Uh, my name is uh, Cedros Lapsatis. I'm a Greek uh, from an island called Kefalonia. And I work with uh, Life at the Last in Lesbos. Uh, we do swimming lessons here for the refugees. We think it's important for the refugees to enjoy the water. You know, it's something they've had traumatizing experiences. Uh, most of them, some of them, or if not many of them, can't swim. Uh, I believe these people deserve to have fun and relax and appreciate the water, you know, the sea, the way we do. Teach me! Teach you! What, what do you want to know? Everything! Everything? Yeah. Have you ever been in the water? Yes! In the boat! <laughs> Not like this, man. It's, you know, I'm scared sometimes when I thought about, you know, being in the boat and, you know, driving, it's different from being in the water. <laughs> Isn't this better? Uh, this is much better. <laughs> we risked our lives to find a place where we can be assured that there is security. We do that because back home there is war, there is suffering. There are a lot of things that happen in our country that we can't live with. Here it's good because we can swim a little. It takes away stress. Many are scared of water, um, so we try that they relax in water because um, you can only swim when you really like all relaxed in your body and you can concentrate on swimming and doing the movements. So we first do something like that. Oh. And it's surprisingly, like, many people are fascinated how easy it is to do, but it's really relaxing and it helps them a lot to gain trust in water and how to swim. And then we slowly start by um, always with, like, a floaty or some kind of thing. So they float on water with their upper chest, we hold their hands and then trying to do with their feet like this. It's really important for the people to be connected uh, with the earth, with the water, to feel like to feel like the sea is a part of them, and not something that took away their family. So it's like a way to get free people out. It's like. No borders for you see everywhere, no borders. If people are afraid of the water, it's something like the border for them. What we do here is to get the people familiarized with the water and feel comfortable and play games because water is fun. Yes, it's good. The water is good. We should continue like this. People should help us do this. We do have water in Africa, but here it is good, better. It's good to swim. Thank you, Micah Guerin. A little bit of good news uh, in a very tough part of the world.